You know, when we're open to a relationship with God, He guides us. He gives us the promise of guidance. We're going to talk about that today on your morning cup of inspiration. You know, God promises to guide us throughout our lives. Over in Psalms 48, 14, it says, For this God is our God forever and ever. He will be our guide even to the end. He's with us to the end. He will be our guide. When we receive Christ into our lives, when we open ourselves up to him, God guides us. He promises to guide us. You know, the thing about it is, God's purpose for us is bigger than we have. You know, I've made many mistakes throughout my life, even after I've accepted Christ. But God has never stopped guiding me. And he'll do the same for you, too. He doesn't have ups and downs like we do. Our everyday stuff might be up here or down there. We, we know we go like this through life. But God doesn't. He's like this always. And he has our best interest in mind. The thing is, this, you can trust in his unwavering faithfulness always. He will always be there for you. And how does he do that? Well, he does that in several different ways. He does it through the scriptures. When we're studying the scriptures, he teaches us. He opens our eyes and ears to things that he wants us to know and to show us, to guide us in the ways he wants us to go. He also counsels us through his Holy Spirit. We get that still small voice in our head that's talking to us and it's guiding us as we're going through life's journey. He also guides us through the church. He counsels us through that, through, through our sermons that we hear and through counsel to the saints. When we have problems and we go to the folks of the church, our elders and that we talk to them, they've been through things too. And things that they may tell us, God will trigger in our mind that this is something that we need to hear, we need to be abiding by, we need to be doing in our own lives. And by that, he gives us common sense. And he helps us to use our common sense to know that right from wrong or what's going to work best for our lives in the directions that he's leading us. And last but not least, he uses circumstantial signs, things that happen. As, you know, we may be doing something and we're going, you know, this isn't quite right. I see the sign in something that's happening here. I'm getting a sign. I'm getting a message in my mind. This isn't right. And we turn around from that. God puts those signs in our life for that very reason to guide us. So he gives us the promise of guidance and he'll always be there for us. When we have a relationship with God, he guides us. We allow him to guide us. And he does that for us. And he will do that for you today too. All by accepting Jesus. Just accept Jesus as your Lord and Savior. It's that simple. He will guide you. He wants to guide you. He will be your guide through life. God bless you everyone. I look forward to seeing you again for another morning cup of inspiration. Have a great day.